tell you everyone that I'm gonna be reacting to the odd ones out. Let's see which video to react to. I watched a lot of them already. Cause I really like his videos. Um by the way, if I actually post this on YouTube, because I don't know how the sound will be, I don't know if the actual video sound will actually show up during this recording but hopefully it will and well i just wanna tell you all that i'll be putting his channel link in the description so let's watch tales of donating so i was blood. sitting in the doctor chair because i was about to donate blood because i do that and i was thinking Ugh. <laughs> i was sitting in the doctor chair donating blood because i do that yeah because everybody else does it too james you're not the only one that does it the next video is like six minutes long. That's twice as long as my other videos. I need to come up with a super short video to keep my viewers quen. So it's sitting in the. <laughs> what even is happening anymore? Cutter room eating my pretzels. You know, okay, what happened to the good food you'd get when you donated blood? I remember a year ago when I started donating, they had fruit snacks and double stuffed Oreos and apple juice. Ooh, but I didn't actually know they exist because obviously I'm only 10 and I turned 10 this year, okay? Turned 10 this year, which basically kind of sort of means that I never really donated blood before, so I never really got those sugary little snack things. I can find those perfectly at the shop. <laughs> now it's like, here's some water and some pretzels. You're a real hero, you know? Like, that was one of the main reasons I donated blood. Oh, you saved so many lives. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just give me my Oreos. <laughs> That's why you donated blood, James. Like, if I was roommates with Dracula, and he offered to cook me a meal, like a good tasting meal for a cup of my blood, I would accept it in a heartbeat. <laughs> I mean, not every day, obviously. Maybe like every Friday. So this happens, so this all- Every Friday, obviously. Wait, guys, I had to stop recording. I'm back, guys. <laughs> I mean, not every day, obviously. Maybe like every Friday. So this happened. So this all happened about an hour ago. Well, probably like two days ago when this video comes out. And if you're watching it a year from now, it happened about a year ago. So sorry if I don't sound as animated as usual. So it is entirely possible that someone watching this has my blood in them. And I think that. I don't think it does, James, because we are come from completely different countries. Makes us related by blood. So I got into the blood donation business because my dad because my dad has O negative blood, which is the universal donor blood. They keep O negative blood on ambulances because O negative can give to everyone. There's no blood tests needed, but I'm O positive, which is the most common blood type. So I'm not special. One time when I was in one time I was in a child development class and I don't know how the topic came up, but my table started talking about blood types. And I said, Oh, I'm O positive. And this girl across from me says, Oh, I forget mine, but my doctor said I'm the universal donor. And I said, Oh, that means you're O negative. And then the teacher walks by and is like, Oh, you're talking about blood types? What are what are you, uh girl? And she says, O neg. She said, Oh O neg. <laughs> Imagine how awkward that is. Neg. Like, so many people have asked her what her blood type is, and she didn't want to waste her time any more than she had to by saying, a Tim. You didn't even know what your blood type was until I said it. And then, I don't remember why, but she got her donor card out of her purse, and it says what blood type you have, and she says, huh, on here it says I have O positive. Hmm. So I guess O positive is the universal donor. And oh my gosh. Universal donor is O negative. Not O positive, so you don't have the universal donor. Blood. You know those moments where you want to argue with someone because you're so obviously right, but you just don't care enough and you don't want to talk to the person any longer than you have to? You know those moments? So I go, oh, yeah, I guess you're right. I'm sorry what you had to go through, James. Okay, so now we're at the end of the video. If any of you okay, the end of the video, which means that switch to another video. A really short one because I can't make the video too long. Come on, come on, a really short video. I don't know what, what to watch, honestly. I just watched like halfway through a video, you know, you know what I'm saying? 
I'm gonna be real with you guys. I don't know a lot about cameras. And the only lighting I have to worry about is what direction it's coming from so I know where to draw the shadows. Guys, we hit a pretty big milestone today. This was a long time coming, but as of today, I hit 21 years of age. It's my birthday. Now I can drink, finally. Don't tell the cops that I filmed this before my birthday. I won't. <laughs> George, you're like breathing heavily and you're like really close to the microphone. Is that, can you guys hear that? Can you guys hear my dog breathing? <laughs> it's fun, it's fun. Oh, also it's Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. You're not a mother. You know, I was watching some of my old videos back when I had about 100K and all I can think is that first 100,000, you had low standards. Some of you might be new here and you're probably thinking, James, what's going on? Well, every time this channel hits a subscriber milestone, I like to get a cake and put on sprinkles equal to the number of how many subscribers we have. So. Okay, so guys, basically he just weighed this, the sprinkles. So let's skip this part and just get to the part where he actually puts the sprinkles on the cake. And a cake cake, it's actually More his than me. So, so let's, let's just, just uh, let's just get started. Oh, the adorable poopy. I mean puppy, not poopy. <laughs> I'm ridiculous. We're gonna need a bigger pool. Why do I have a feeling he's gonna do something really bad with that pool? Please don't tell me he's gonna throw his office chair. No! <laughs> Honestly, I don't think anybody would let. Is is he wearing princess floaties? Oh no, this is awkward. Hashtag James Aesthetic. I'm gonna put that in the title, maybe. So each of these, it's like what? One, one person? Just about? And I'm one of those people. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you all very, very much. And I will see you guys again. Boo-boo!